So what makes fish sashimi grade? Is there someone out there who's going around from business to business certifying that a fish can be sashimi grade? Well, no, it's, it's a bit of a, a, a marketing term in, in the industry which talks about the best quality fish. And to be sashimi grade, the fish has to be as fresh as possible and from certain cuts and parts of the fish. So if you're eating fish for sushi and sashimi here in the UK, we think that frozen is going to be the best option. It goes back to our core principle that a lot of what is actually sold as fresh is days, if not a week, two weeks old by the time you actually eat it fresh. So we freeze it immediately uh, or as quick as possible, which locks in that freshness. Frozen has a number of other benefits when it comes to sushi and sashimi, and particularly tuna. Super frozen is a term which describes the freezing of sashimi grade tuna at below minus 60. Uh, they, they freeze it at such cold temperatures to re retain the taste, texture and appearance of the sushi fish. If, if you don't do that, it will start to go brown as it oxidizes or you'll have to treat it with some chemicals. So super frozen is the best for freezing. And we're really excited that we've actually got a super freezer here now and all of our tuna is super frozen. Another benefit to frozen sashimi grade tuna is that it is more sustainable to move around the planet. So it's caught at source, processed, frozen, and then shipped by cargo boat, as opposed to a lot of other sashimi grade tuna, which is flown in by air. Obviously air is you know, worse for the CO2 emissions than moving uh, around by, by, by cargo boat. And actually uh, there's been a little bit of a case study on our frozen tuna versus fresh tuna, which you can find on the Seafish website. In the UK, us retailers or pubs, restaurants have to legally freeze fish that's gonna be eaten for raw consumption, just as a control measure to make sure there's no uh, nasty parasites in there. So if anyone's telling you my sushi grade fish is the freshest as possible, they're either not telling you the full truth or they're not following the letter of the law. So, uh, you know, I go back to the point, frozen is better. Two things to think about when you are working with sashimi grade tuna. First, defrost it in your fridge overnight. I wrap it in a little bit of kitchen towel that absorbs some of that excess moisture that comes out, which you want to get rid of when you are slicing the fish. Second, your knife has to be extremely sharp. And I like a long knife too, so you can get it all in one stroke and you're not sawing away. Also, when you are cutting it, feel free to you know, run some water over it or, or a paper towel so you've got a nice clean stroke every time. And that way you get some nice strips like that. Enjoy.